In recent days, the Dow Jones Industrial Average has been challenging the uh, 14,000 mark, a uh, significant psychological barrier. There's reason to believe that this is an anticipation of the most momentous collapse in stock prices in history. In fact, the collapse is approaching could very well entail the end of capitalism, uh, the end of Western civilization as we know it, the <clears throat> and the end of America. The reason I believe this is that uh, there is a pattern to the stock market, um, fractal-based pattern, which is uh, e explained by the Elliott Wave Principle. And the Elliott Wave Principle basically holds that the stock prices in mass mood and the cycles of uh, the economy and social history are cycles within cycles within cycles. And based upon examining these patterns in the movement of stock prices, you're able to project future, future price movements. The, um, with regard to Dow 14,000, the strange thing is, is that the stock market tends to peak around psychologically important thousand marks in the Dow Jones Industrial Average and then enter um, dramatic reversals. Um, often these reversals entail significant geopolitical events. Um, two quick examples of that was the Yom Kippur War, Arab-Israeli War, the last major Arab-Israeli War in 1973, which occurred just after the Dow Jones Industrial Average challenged the 1,000 mark. In that was in October 1973, and in July of 19, of uh, 1990, the Dow went up and closed at the psychological uh, up towards the 3,000 mark. It closed at 2,999.75 two days in a row. Um, and on July 16th and 17th, which precisely coincided when Saddam made a speech, Saddam Hussein made a speech threatening Kuwait. Uh, Iraq then massed troops on Kuwait, the stock market fell 5%. Iraq then invaded Kuwait, and the stock market fell 25%. This uh, pattern of reversals from psychologically important thousand marks uh, shows that there's some sort of method to the madness or order with regard to the unfolding of history. Um, that is what I think the Elliott Wave taps upon and specifically in, in terms of the Elliott Wave what we've approached over the past uh, s uh, several years really since since the year 1999 uh, to 2000 is a grand super cycle peak. Um, the most important um, top in human history. This basically marks the peak of Western civilization, the peak of Pax Americana, and the peak of of the reign of uh, uh, um, capitalism. The the reversal, therefore, should coincide with the um, uh, um, unraveling of Western civilization, the end of Pax Americana, and the collapse of capitalism. What form could this take? I believe that's what I foresaw some uh, 22 years ago, right around this this time, February. Um, it was February of 1991 when I had an apocalyptic vision of uh, uh, a third world war that would begin with a chemical scud attack in Israel. Um, for that, you can check out my other videos and see what, what that's all about. Um, so just a heads up that we seem to be peaking around the 14,000 mark. What should follow is the grand super cycle collapse in stock prices as projected by the Elliott Wave principle. And uh, this very well may entail the fulfillment of, of uh, b biblical prophecies of the apocalypse that uh, outlines the um, um, uh, transformation of the world, which I think uh, is about to get underway.